I hope you guys reinspect those welds. What's that? You better reinspect those welds. I don't have anything to do with that. Well, you better tell your boss he better do it or you're going to dig it all back up. If it's not redone, you guys are going to dig it all back up. And that's a fact. So you better figure out who's supposed to do it. Because that shit ain't going to leak into this guy's well. You guys better recheck those wells. And this is the location where the infamous, all the photos are being taken because it's so close, but pipe's just dangling out there, waiting to go underneath my electrical there. Today we had a, a crane flip over when they were trying to install the pipeline behind our home. And uh, after they righted the crane, they moved the bent and broken crane out of the way. The pipeline dropped about 20 feet or so. Um, on one end where the ground wasn't excavated, the pipe basically went across the land and bent possibly. I, I really don't know. Um, the question is, is that it definitely did fall and drop into the hole and then it, on one end it, it fell. and. We don't know if the pipe is compromised. You know, they're, they just put it in just the same. And we don't know, like, if there's pinholes or how bad the damage could be. You know, it would be great if there was no damage. But from what we saw today, how could it not be? I mean, it's just one cover-up after another. And you ask the workers, you know, don't, isn't this pipe supposed to be inspected now since it was dropped? And the workers say, well, that's not our problem. That's somebody else's problem. Well, I'm the landowner who lives here. That's a real reassuring thought from anybody along the line. So what do you think about them burying the pipe after they just dropped it? Possible welds could be uh, compromised. And it's right in your backyard. Well, I think we just pretty much covered that on the phone where it's a bunch of BS. This is a joke. This is, this is like Fisher Price construction. 